The idea from the beginning has been to celebrate Laminate simply as it is. Its strengths, its limitations, its aspirations. For this single plural 2019, EDL has asked us to explore their stone laminate collections. A high pressure laminate is able to blend paper and finish into a surface that seems to be another material entirely. And we found ourselves intrigued by the opposing qualities of heavy, blocky stone somehow embedded within light, thin sheets of laminate. This counterintuitive combination challenged us to create something that might be perceived as neither stone nor laminate alone, but something more than both. The result is a material perception, an illusion, that goes far beyond its raw ingredients. Interweaving these ideas of illusion and transformation, we imagine an object that creates the illusion of stone at first glance, yet, as you approach it, the hard, imposing solid morphs into a soft, airy veil. This is how we arrived at Boulder. The process of making Boulder started off in experimentation. We basically found out that laminate is actually a really flexible material. Once we learn how to heat it, once we learn how to bend it, we are able to create like a curved complex surface based on all of this experimentation. The sculpture itself actually is a representation of how digital fabrication and material study comes together. What we do is we try to combine the process in a digital and a physical way. The material study of the bending behavior of the laminates coupled with a computation model creates a digital physical feedback loop that allows us to decipher the complexity of the sculpture boulder. It's then broken down into 473 unique pieces. The outcome is a gradient of shapes that becomes a proof of concept which weaves computation with craft. In a sculpture that redefines the expectations of what laminate should be.